Our account above all formulates the ability of recognizing sums on a visual level, a basic skill which is necessary for learning mathematics and arithmetic. Besides this, it also helps with learning basic mathematical operations and notations and to strengthen focus and speed of thinking. Inside the box you will find the rules and two decks of cards. In one deck you will find three types of animal cards, hedgehogs, frogs and birds in different amounts from 1 to 8. The second deck consists of setup cards, a comparison of sum of animals between each other and a comparison of the sum of animals with numbers and the exact amount. All cards from the animal deck are dealt equally among the players. One card is placed from the setup deck face up in the middle of the table. Each player in turn opens the top card from their stack and places it face up on the table. Take the card by the farthest edge so all players can see the card simultaneously. Each new card is placed on top of the previously opened card fully covering it. Only top cards are played. When you see that the condition from the setup card is met by the open animal cards on the table, you need to quickly cover the setup card and yell, got it. The fastest player wins the round, takes all the stacks of open animal cards on the table, including his own, and places them face down at the bottom of his stack. The aim is to collect as many cards as possible. If a player mistakenly covered the card and yelled, got it, he gets a penalty and he gives one animal card to each player. A nuance. If the condition is, for example, more hedgehogs than birds, and the open card on the table does have hedgehogs but no birds, it still means the condition is met and the player yells, got it. Since there are no birds, it means there is zero birds on the card, which is less than two hedgehogs. The same with equation. The task is, for example, frogs less than seven. If there are no frogs on the open card at all, The condition is met and the player yells, got it. If the exact amount deck card is open, it means that the amount of any animal on all animal cards should be equal to the number on the card. The game is over when all deck cards have been played and the player with the most animal cards wins. Or when all players except one run out of animal cards. To make the game easier and more comfortable for younger children, you can use a simplified version of the rules. First of all, you can start by using simple cards. All animal and setup cards are marked with either one, two or three dots which represent the level of difficulty. So you can start playing with cards with one dot and gradually introduce cards with two and three dots. Or you may want to remove the element of speed from the game and allow kids to take time analysing open cards. Thus only the player who opened the last animal card can yell, got it. If the player thinks that the condition is not met, the cards remain in place and the turn moves to the next player. And that's it, enjoy the game!